Using the general American definition as basis, the Legion track and field superstar Kaina Martinez was the best athlete in her sport for the 2017 NCAA Outdoor Track and Field Championship. On Saturday, Martinez helped her Texas A&M team to a 16-point finish, which saw the Belizean athlete post an 11.58 seconds time in the 100-meter dash, good enough for second place, and 24.10 seconds in the 200-meter dash, good for third place. Kaina's team placed third in the 4x100 relay, running a time of 44.98 seconds. According to Javelina Sports, the performance on Saturday meant that Kaina Martinez walked away from the 2017 NCAA Outdoor Track and Field Championships as a three-time All-American. Today, PGTV spoke via Facebook with Kaina Martinez and we offered her congratulations on her performance. Saturday, I competed in the NCAA D2 National Track and Field Outdoor Championship and I made it for, actually it was four events, but I got out of one. Um, so I just did the 4x1, the uh, 100 and the 200 meters for nationals. And it was my last outdoor college track and field competition. For me, I was a little disappointed because um, I went in with the top seed as a 200, a top seed for all three events. And me, I came up kind of like top eight. But I knew or I wanted to be champion for all three, but unfortunately that did not happen. But um, I guess overall it was a great track meet for me, given the entire year and how difficult it was for me in the beginning, coming back from uh, last year's disappointment and having to face the same uh, events was kind of like difficult for me. But uh, overall, I guess that that's a that's a good season. Be recognized a three-time All-American again, which adds up to my All-American status as a track and field outdoor athlete. So, yeah. what's next for Kaina Martinez? I guess that it's, that that's a very good question because. Um, what I learned about life is that I'm not going to uh, be close-minded. I remain open-minded as to what not then or what will be next. It's hard for me to say what is next. I want to say that I will focus more on my education and eventually be a um, ought to be a mentor for others. Um, but I can't a lot of experiences and I really don't know I really don't know what's next but I know great things are yet ahead when are you coming back to Belize if you if only for a visit well I'm planning to do my trade camp again but um, unfortunately I don't have much funds in order for me to do that again but if I do get funding um, I will be more than um, more than willing to do what I love, what I have a passion for, youth sports as a catalyst to help you to be empowered, help them to know that things can be accomplished. It doesn't have to be sports. Um, it can be anything because, I mean, a lot of people know me to do sports, but sports is not the only thing that I'm kind of going to do. Um, I, have, I have a passion for other stuff, but I just use the sport to help be one that I do. Um, help inspire other people so now that the season is over for you are going to take some time off travel and uh, just vacation well travel i would love to do travel but um financially it's not happening so um the only next thing i can say is i'm gonna relax for a while and get back into it because I look forward to compete next door next year as unattached because this year is my last year as a student athlete. I have to complete my degree 
and since as Toby is co assisting with um, uh, past farmers, um, college um, track mates, um, I will keep in shape and see what goes on from there. But at the end of the day, after achieving my education, um, I look forward to what the future holds for me when it comes to that aspect of life, utilizing my education to um, help me move forward as, as much as what's next that life has to offer, you know? I can't see myself keep on competing and sibling for nothing, you know? So, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what's next. But like I said, I will not remain closed-minded. I am open-minded to anything and everything because everything doesn't happen the way you want it to, you know? Things make changes, you just have to adjust and figure out how best you can work around and with the situation, which is what I look forward to.